In this video, we'll examine the cost of solar panels with data compiled by our partner, Energy Sage. How much your solar project will cost you will depend on things like your roof type, if it's a ground mount, the solar system size, the solar panel quality, the inverter, and the investment tax credit. The IRS solar tax credit is a valuable incentive for homeowners, but not everyone can take advantage of it. You will not receive the full benefit of the 30% solar tax credit if you pay little to no federal taxes. To learn more, watch our video, Nine Key Points About the Solar Tax Credit. The national average price of solar power systems is around $2.86 per watt. This means that a 10 kilowatt system would cost $28,600 before any incentives or solar tax credits are applied. Other items will also affect your final cost. Here are some factors that can impact the cost of the solar system for your home. The price of solar panels increases with higher quality, like any product or appliance. SunPower is a good example because their panels are recognized for their superior quality and efficiency, which is why they cost more per watt. Here is a chart from Energy Sage comparing four panels and their price ranges. SunPower ranges from $3.12 per watt to $3.74 per watt. That means how much a 10 kilowatt sun power system will cost ranges between $31,200 to $37,400. On the chart, we also see the range for Q-cells, REC panels, and Panasonic. Where you live affects the price of your solar. Energy Sage data shows that Arizona has the lowest average cost per watt at $2.33 which means that a 10 kilowatt system costs $23,300. That same 10 kilowatt system will cost you $28,600 on average in California. States with hotter climates like Arizona tend to have higher household electricity consumption because of increased air conditioner usage. Although the prices are lower for solar, you will need a bigger system to offset higher consumption. That's why some of the biggest solar systems are found in states like Arizona, Nevada, and Texas, which get lots of sunshine. The price of solar is not only based on equipment, but also on the difficulty of the installation itself. The type of roof you have can increase the installation cost. For example, if your roof has multiple planes, dormers, or skylights, the installation process may require extra equipment and effort, leading to additional costs. Other factors, such as electrical panel upgrades, ground mounts, delicate tile, flat roofs, and steep roofs, can also increase the cost. The solar installation company you choose also affects how much you'll pay for your solar system. Some installers charge extra for things like tile roofs, two-story roofs, and multiple roof planes while others do not. Energy Sage simplifies the process of finding solar installers in your area with their solar marketplace. They offer the lowest prices, thoroughly evaluate the installers, and provide guidance on how to compare them against each other. How you pay for your system can also affect the overall cost. You have three primary options, paying cash, getting a solar loan, or leasing. A cash purchase is a good option if you want to maximize your savings from solar, especially if you can take advantage of the 30% solar tax credit. A no money down solar loan is a great option if you don't have the funds available to pay for a solar panel system in cash. A solar lease or a power purchase agreement may be the right choice if you are not eligible for the 30% federal solar tax credit. Solar rebates and incentives can help you reduce the net cost of your solar installation. These incentives vary depending on the state you live in and your utility company. No matter where you live in America, the 30% investment tax credit is the best incentive for going solar. A $30,000 system will be eligible for a $9,000 solar tax credit, reducing the net cost to $21,000. To find out what incentives are available in your area, ask your Energy Sage advisor, who will help you to identify and take advantage of all the available incentives and maximize your return on investment. Finally, the cost of maintenance. Since there are no moving parts, solar panels require little maintenance throughout their lifetime. 
However, your solar array's efficiency may require periodic tree trimming to prevent shading on the panels or hiring a solar panel cleaner if you reside in a dusty area or near a construction site that causes debris to accumulate on your panels. We recommend doing research on EnergySage and comparing prices using their online solar marketplace before making a decision so that you can get the most for your money. Click the link in the description below. With the help of EnergySage, you can start generating free, clean energy and save around 20% on your solar system. If you want to learn more about solar and the different options available to you, visit CaliforniaSolarGuide.com. And remember to like, share, subscribe, and hit the bell to receive our latest videos on solar energy and other solar-related topics.